Hi, Les from Thailand. And this video is going to be about my wife set up her own business because she got bored. And then she decided to do something rather than just sitting on the hammock all day and playing games and doing nothing. So she set up her own trading business, selling clothes at the market. But now because of the situation, she hasn't done it now for a few months and she's going to wait until the situation resolves itself. Now she does it just for a hobby, she doesn't do it for making money really, but though she does make a little bit of money, but she does it because she enjoys it and it gives her the contact with other Thai people. So I'm going to go through giving the motorbike a dry off because I just give it a wash and I'll go through it. So this is commonly known as a Samlaw, a motorbike and sidecar. They are one of the best things you could buy here in Thailand. It's so versatile, it's so economical to run and insure. 610 baht to insure tax and test this motorbike and sidecar. 610 baht. Okay, the insurance isn't very much at all. It doesn't give you much cover, but it's like third party insurance. So if you hit somebody else, at least they're insured and covered by your insurance for accident and things like that. Now this motorbike and sidecar, we, we've had it now for just over a year and we paid 28,000 baht for it second hand and my wife uses this to go to the market. So my wife bought all the market equipment and I'll put some pictures of the stalls and the clothes that she bought and etc etc and I'll give you a breakdown as to how much that costs her to to buy and set up all of the market equipment but I bought this it was my contribution towards her because she wanted to set up her own market business and we use it for going to the beach and just for tootling around and my wife feels much safer driving this dra than driving our little motorbike and it's very very useful I've got to say in fact I probably enjoy driving this more than I drive the car so here's a picture of my wife's doll she got a friend of the family to to make this and it's like a, a double unit she got this made it's four meters wide two units each unit consisting of two meter wide so she can either have it as a, a two meter setup or a, a big shop at four meters depending on how much room at the market she's got it all clips together and it all fits on this motorbike and sidecar so a whole business is transported through this and again I'll put some pictures on as to when everything's loaded up all the clothes all the market stall and everything fits very neatly onto this and it's great because it's just so convenient we can fit more stuff in here than we can fit in my car for going to the market realistically if you go to the market selling clothes like my wife does you need the truck and we've got the car and I prefer the car because the car is much cheaper to the run than the truck so this was a good buy for 28,000 baht but then it cost us another 2,000 baht to get it. the ownership transferred over to my wife's name and that and we got it serviced so it's only done 14,000 kilometers it's seven year old but it looks just like new it's very good so as you can see the, the pictures of the clothes we go to Bangkok every now and then to buy a stock and my wife spends about 30,000 baht getting all brand new stock and we do that maybe it's twice a year as I say she doesn't sell a lot but it, it what she does sell it's her hobby and it's her interest and it keeps her happy and we get, a, get to holiday in Bangkok for a little while we go there for two days we stay at the Beok Hotel which is right in Prathenham Market so you just go out the door and you're in the market 
itself and it's wonderful she gets everything she wants there reasonably priced and then when she goes to the market here it costs uh, 50 baht a day to go into the market and some days she has good days and some days she has bad days but she's never been to the market and not sold anything so so she does make a bit of a profit and but she likes the enjoyment of being going out to talk to other Thai people rather than sat at home talk to me all the time and you know because we sort of live in a, a remote village so we don't have that many people around here and the only time we have social contact with other Frangs is when we have parties and things like that we're not bar people so we keep ourselves for ourselves mainly and that's the way we like it but for the whole stall 2,000 baht to get the stall made 30,000 for this 30,000 to get all the stock so let's call it 65,000 baht and she's got her own business set up and she does the market twice a week or she did do the market twice a week until this bloody Covid came so she doesn't do the market now because she doesn't need to do it it's not as if she needs the money she just does it for social contact and that's the way it works so we just sort of kept the stock clean and tidy until this situation resolves itself and then we go back to how it was before we miss our holidays we miss our we used to go on holiday once a month for a couple of days long weekend but now we just amuse ourselves at home so anyway there's another video on here about this motorbike how it's fixed and how it's put together and testing I'll put a link on that so it's a nice video to watch so watch that if you want so if you like this video give it a thumbs up if you didn't like it give it a thumbs down subscribe would be nice to my channel it helps me along so from Les Retired and living the dream until the next video. Bye for now.